Okay. Okay, Irma, Catherine, let's wait for the rest of the people. Okay, there's Nidia. Okay, good. Everybody's coming back now. Edson Stanley, where's that picture that you have? What's that behind you? I'm sorry, teacher. In your picture, you are, where are you? Uh, it's the download Google. <laughs> No, no, no. Um, not, a... not, not your background. The picture you have. There's a picture that you have a red shirt, square shirt. A square shirt. Okay, Stanley. Right now, you are in okay. video, correct? Okay. Okay, I'm not talking about the video. You have a picture, your profile picture. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Where it's are the... you? Is is in in los platos? I don't remember the the uh, lugar. But it's in los. Is, is in los is, um, sí, yes, it's in it's in um, los planes. Oh, okay. Oh, it's here. Los it's planes. Fine. Pero, perdón, pero no recuerdo muy bien. Oh, okay, no problem. No, but, si, but, si but, it, but it is here in El Salvador. Yes, it's in Salvador. Yes. Oh, okay. Right. Okay, so. Does everybody see? Oh, wait, let me share my screen. Do you see my screen? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. All right, thank yes, you. Thank you. Okay, so we have knowledge check. Instructions, complete the conversations with would and the appropriate form of the verbs in parentheses. Some will be in the form of infinitive and others just verbs. So for example, Edgar, Abel, can you do number one, please? Okay. Would you prefer to take a, a course in exercise science or nutritional science? Okay. Very good. Would you prefer to take? Yeah. Okay. Number two, Nidia. I prefer it. Um... Sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't, know. I don't remember, teacher. I it's, it's register a noun or a verb? Okay, no, no problem. Okay, yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Uh, somebody, Irma, what is number two? I would prefer. To, to register for nutritional science because it's more useful for my nursing. Good. There's the lecture case I prefer. We know it has to have two. Yes, I would prefer to register. Number three, Laura. No, I'm sorry. No, number two. Again, can you do two A and B, please? Okay. Uh, would you rather learn English in Australia or Canada? 
Be, I think I would prefer study in Australia because it's warmer there. Okay. I think I prefer to study. Yes, to study. Sorry, I, I read uh, rather. <laughs> no, that's okay. Yes. Okay, number three. Edson Stanley, can you do number three, please? Do A and B. Edson Stanley, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Can you do number three, please? Uh, if you needed to learn a new skill, would you prefer to attend a class? Or a prepared tutorial. Uh, the request is to. The question have... is wrong. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Please ignore me. Ignore me. <laughs> Go ahead, please. Go ahead. Is to have it? To have. To have. All right. And B, what is the answer? Oh, I'm sorry. And the B is uh, I'd rather sing up for a uh, not the same. Yeah. Then, <laughs> yes, then. Uh, we stand here to, to uh, hire it. Hire, hire it. Hire it. Okay, can you repeat, please? To hire it? No, it's higher. Hired. Higher, not higher. Higher. Yes. Okay, so can you read Can you read B again, please? I'd rather... I'd rather sing up for a... Class. Oh, yeah. class. Es que, es que está como... Sí, está eh, mal escrito. Sí. <laughs> Class then uh, hire a tutor. 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 Hire a tutor. Tutor. Stanley, do you know what a tutor is? Repeat. Do you know do you know what a tutor is? Mm. Mm, not understand the, the, the do the you do you know what a tutor is a tutor no i don't teacher it's similar in spanish mm, no okay <laughs> not to talk. So, listen wait 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 wait, wait. please 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 don't say anything well, then I, I, I need to explain. So listen, Edson, if you need to learn a new skill, listen, because look, le digo, if you don't understand the question, it's impossible to say the correct answer. So listen, if you needed to learn a new skill, would you prefer to attend a class or have a private Tutor. Okay, okay. I understand. It. Now you understand tutor? Yes. yes. Okay, good. Yeah, you see, <laughs> if you need to read two, three, four times, good. Do it. But you have okay. to understand what you're you have to understand what you're receiving and what you're giving. Okay. So now so look, if you needed to learn a new skill, would you prefer to attend a class or to have a private tutor so i rather signed up for a class than to hire a tutor uh, i have a question teacher what is the higher the mean higher yeah that was, that was my next question <laughs> what, <laughs> is, what is what is the next what what is higher higher is when you pay somebody okay for example, um, imagine you go to a job interview. 
Tomorrow you go to uh, aplicar a what? Um, Telus. Okay. And, you know, and if you pass the exam, then they tell you, congratulations, Edson, you are hired. Hmm. You start Monday. Okay, teacher. So do you understand what hired is? Yes, teacher. Es como contratado. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. You are hired. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, teacher, for help. Yeah, good. Very good. Pero lo que quiero que vea ahí, Stanley, es si te das cuenta, entendiste todo, volviéndolo a leer. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> y sacándole lógica al, al, yeah, so that's how you do it. And yes. let's do number four. Okay, uh, Cecilia de Los Angeles, Adrián Ramos. Can you do number four A and B, please? Okay, uh, Laura, can you please do number four A and B, please? Okay. Would you rather join a, a core? Core. How do you pronounce? Core. 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 Or an orchestra. 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 I would rather sing in a core than play in an orchestra. Okay, good. Questions? What is a core? No. Um, where many people sing songs in a church, for example. Mm -hmm, in a church, yeah. I'm I'm sorry, I have a terrible voice. <laughs> Hey, saben quién cantaba en un coro? Marilyn Manson y Axl oh. Rose, el coro de la iglesia. Oh, me too. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, but you, can you imagine Marilyn Manson when he was a little boy? He sang Elvis in the... Elvis Presley too. Okay, but compare Elvis Presley to Marilyn Manson. <laughs> no, that can't be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Marilyn Manson's like, it's crazy satanic. <laughs> yeah. I like Marilyn Manson. He's good. <laughs> the beautiful people. The beautiful people. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, A, if you needed to learn a new skill, would you prefer to attend a class or to have a private student? Without. No. Yeah. yeah. No, it's but up. I'm sorry. Uh, this is... Remember what I told you yesterday, the, the platform and yeah. No, but this, I think it's because there's already a verb. There's already a two, right? Yeah, they yeah. Two. And the other Before. one uh, is rather so there's not have to be two. Exactly. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. It's the same for me, Kuipa. That was my fault here. <laughs> y aquí, yes, porque estaba two, right? Yeah. Yes, true. Exactly. Pero también se puede decir tú. There's no problem. Would you rather go to the beach or to the mountains? It's correct too. All right. Yeah, there's no problem. Okay. Listen to three people talk about the part-time courses they took recently. What course did each person take? Did you hear that? Can you hear? Okay, sorry. No, still in pause. They took recently. No? Yes. Okay. Yeah. List yes. of three people talk about the part-time courses they took recently. What course did each person take? One, Linda. So, Linda, what have you been doing with yourself? Not much. Oh, wait. What does, what does the instructions want you to do?
they know what kind of card they take. Yes, it says listen to the three people and what they courses they took, correct? Yeah. Entonces, we have Linda, Rich, and Gwen. Those are the three people. So now we have that information. Aunque ahorita solimos, hello, Linda, pero sabemos que va a haber un Rich y un Gwen. So always, always do that. Always read the question before you listen. So you can you can concentrate more on the answer. That's not true. I took this. So Linda, what have you been doing with yourself? Not much. Oh, wait, that's not true. I took this great dancing class last semester. Oh, yeah? What kind of dancing? We learned African dance and samba. Wait, why would you want to learn African dance and samba? It sounds exhausting. And it's not like you would dance that way in the clubs. Oh, just for fun. You should try taking the class. You'll see that you learn more than just dancing. You also learn how to be more confident and how to interact better with other people. Hmm. I think with all that dancing around, I'd be too exhausted to interact with anyone. Two. Rich. So, how did you enjoy your cooking course? It was great. What kinds of things did you learn to cook? Well, it was a course on vegetarian cooking. I didn't know you were a vegetarian. Oh, I'm not. But a lot of people are these days. So I thought it would be useful to know how to make some interesting dishes without meat for times when I invite friends over for dinner. Hmm. Well, I guess that makes sense. Oh, but we learn more than just cooking. They also taught us all kinds of useful things about, you know, the health value of different kinds of vegetables and how to prepare them so that you don't remove all the vitamins they contain. So, uh, when's dinner? Three, Gwen. I just got my grade in the mail. I got an A. Wow, that's terrific. Congratulations. What kind of course was it? It was a course on how to open and run a small business. Oh, did it help? Yes, absolutely. We learned a lot of general principles and a lot about finance. Even if I don't open a business, I learned a lot about investing and managing money. Great. Can you manage my money? My finances are a mess. All right. So, Nidia, what is Linda doing? Linda is an African dance in samba. African dance in samba, good. Um, Irma Karadamis, hi. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Tell me about Rich. Oh, Rich, he, he took a course of vegetarian cooking. Vegetarian cooking, awesome. Okay. And what about when? Uh, I don't know if Tanya, Cecilia, Catherine, Reina. Laura, what about when? He took a course about how to run a small business. Awesome. Let's see if we're right. And correct. Yes, we are right. Okay, now we will listen to how people give some advice. You will see by gerund in context. Let's see what this is about. by listening to music or by watching movies. Hello, sometimes learning a language might be stressful, but you could improve by listening to music or by watching movies. Let's pay attention to the advice given and the following conversation. They might work for you too. 
So, how's your French class going? Not bad, but I'm finding the pronunciation difficult. Well, it takes a while to get it right. You could improve your accent by listening to language CDs. That's a good idea. But how do you learn new vocabulary? I always seem to forget new words. I learn new English words best by writing them on pieces of paper and sticking them on things in my room. I look at them every night before I go to sleep. Hmm, maybe I should try something like that. Listen to two other people explain how they learn new words in a foreign language. What techniques do they use? 1. I keep a record of new words I come across. Then I make up study cards. I write the word on one side of the card and the meaning on the other side. Oh, and I always include at least one sentence with a word in it. Then I go through the cards whenever I have some spare time, like when I'm waiting for my laundry to dry or on the bus, and study the words until I know them by heart. Every week or so, I organize the cards into categories. You know I put all the words together that have to do with food or work or home or school, whatever I can find that my new words have in common. 2. I keep a vocabulary notebook. It's organized alphabetically. Whenever I hear or read a new word, I write it down. Then when I have time, I look it up in my dictionary. Then I put down some key information about the word. You know, whether it's a noun or a verb, and some examples of how it's I can't used. Hear no more. I go through the notebook and study the words as often as I can. You can't hear? I, I'm sorry. I, I think we had a. Don't have sound. Can, can you hear me now? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. I'm sorry about that. I think my internet was okay. Hold on. The cards whenever I have some spare time, like when I'm waiting for my laundry to dry or on the bus, and study the words until I know them by heart. Every week or so. I organize the cards into categories. You know I put all the words together that have to do with food or work or home or school. Whatever I can find that my new words have in common. 2. I keep a vocabulary notebook. It's organized alphabetically. Whenever I hear or read a new word, I write it down. Then when I have time, I look it up in my dictionary. Then I put down some key information about the word. You know, whether it's a noun or a verb, and some examples of how it's used. I go through the notebook and study the words as often as I can. I really believe that the only way to learn new words, even in your own language, is by memorizing them. Which techniques do they use in the conversation? Go ahead and type them on our discussion box. Okay, so in this case, is how to use by with a gerund. It's very simple. Like, let's say, hey, um, I want to lose weight. What should I do? You should start by exercising. You should start by eating less. But did you hear what I said? exercising or eating less no yes maybe yes so it's eating less, less, eating less pupusa. <laughs> yes i'm sorry eating less pupusa yeah by eating less pupusas so edgar imagine okay i'm going to give you in a scenario Imagine 
Edgar, I am an alcoholic. And uh, I'm having problems. This is an example. I am not an alcoholic. I just want to clear that. But um, Edgar, I am an alcoholic and I am having problems. I'm having personal problems within my home. What should I do? Mm. I think it's difficult when someone has trouble. Okay, with, wait, uh, no, wait, uh, hold on. Don't complicate, don't complicate yourself. Don't give okay. me, don't give me a, a big yes. explanation about life. You know, just give okay. me a quick and simple using by and a gerund. Okay. Yes, because I know, no, and thank you. And I understand because if you tell me, you know, it's difficult to be an alcoholic because I'm blind, and then it becomes a, I don't know, a presentation. So, but imagine if I want, give me a quick answer. Okay. You, sh you should stop drinking alcohol. You should. Okay. So you should start by. Stopping. Stopping drinking alcohol. Okay. Okay. You should, uh, you should stop. You should try by stop drinking alcohol. Okay. But I don't drink alcohol. I drink, the I drink, what? I drink liquor. I don't drink alcohol. Okay. You drink like shots? Yes. <laughs> like tequila? Yes. No, mentiras. O sea, yes. No, pero es que if you say alcohol, es como alcohol 90, like literally Al alcohol. I, I call alcohol drinks, yes. I, I uh -huh. guess. Yes. Alcoholic drinks. Yes, that's better. Okay. Very good. Yes. Um, let me see, Irma Galdames. Yes, I'm here. Man, I don't know where all my money goes. Every time I get paid in two days, I have no money. What should uh, I do? Well, I think that you should um start to a. Um, to start avoiding uh, to go malls and say and you you should start by saving uh, money every day at least a quarter <laughs> a quarter a quarter yes yes very good yes you know I there's only one person I have met in my complete life Every day they save one quarter, like one month, one quarter, the second month, two quarters every day. No sé cómo la hacían, but they had a lot of money at the end. <laughs> in, in 10 days are $2.50. and fifty cents. Ten days. No, it's more. No, in ten days. Oh yeah, oh, in ten days is two fifty. Uh, in a month are seven dollars with fifty cents. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? Yeah, it's true. <laughs> All right. You have to eat <laughs> yes. Um, okay, Nidia. I have a problem with insomnia. I can't sleep at night. What do you think is my problem? I don't know. Okay, listen a las palabras claves or look at me. I have a problem. I can't sleep at night. I have insomnia. What should I do? And I have a problem in some is um uh, drink coffee. I don't understand. <laughs> Thank you. 
Mm. Um, sería bueno entiendo que sería que tiene problemas de insomnio o algo así In yes. yes I have problems with insomnia so what should I do eh, eh, I, the problem with insomnia is a uh, drink coffee or much drink coffee okay so what should I do ¿Qué le, qué, le, ¿Qué le diría yo o qué le recomendaría yo? No. ¿Qué, qué está, ¿Cuál es el tema hoy que estamos practicando ahorita? Bueno, la pregunta del insomnio no sé. I don't know. Yeah. Pero es que el problema es que yo la quisiera ayudar, pero como nunca me hacen preguntas, hace el momento nadie nunca me ha hecho teacher, no entiendo. Hey, estoy confundido. ¿Qué estamos haciendo? Y esto va para mucha gente. Si solo se quieren dedicar a hacer la pregunta y hey, la saqué bien, pero sin saber por qué la sacaron bien. No, man, eso, eso no es speak English. No, no solo usted ni o sea, todo en general, porque y a todas las clases que yo siempre tengo les digo lo mismo. Porque siempre a la hora de hacer las preguntas, siempre todas las sacan bien. Ah, es la A, es la B, es la A, es la Ahí, perfect. But a la hora de hablarlo, you don't understand. Entonces, ¿cuál es su objetivo? ¿Quieren solo sacar bien las respuestas? O speak. Yes. If you want to speak, perfect. But if you don't understand, si, si no entienden y no hacen preguntas, y yo me he metido en problemas porque a veces he ofendido a gente. Cuando yo les quiero ayudar, porque yo sé que no entienden y yo les quiero ayudar y se han ofendido como, hey, me hace sentir, okay, I'm sorry. Entonces mejor no les digo nada. Nidia, hice dos ejemplos ahorita. Se lo hice uno a Irma y a Edgar. Y antes de eso vimos un video. Y el video es Bye y Gerundio. Bye con ING. A Edgar le dije que tenía un problema de alcoholismo. Me dijo, you should stop. You should start by stop drinking liquor. Irma me dijo, you should start by saving a quarter every day es el tema buy con el gerundio vio el video entendió el video bueno ok let's continue Laura so yes. ok my example oh man Laura I have insomnia I have a problem. What do you recommend? Maybe you should buy a stopping drinking coffee at evening. Okay. So maybe you should start by. Okay. Maybe you should start by stop, stopping drinking. No. Uh -huh. Stopping drink. Stop drinking. Coffee. Stop drinking. Oh. Mm -hmm. No, yes, Sorry. stop drinking. It's Start correct. By a stop drinking or mm -hmm. a stop or by a stopping drinking. No, by stop drinking. Uh huh. That's correct. And this is an exception. Stop drinking. Okay. Ah, okay. Uh -huh, okay. By a stop drinking coffee at evening. Okay, so very good. Can you repeat the answer, please? Maybe you, you should start by stop drinking coffee at evening. Okay, good. Yeah, man, but it's so difficult for me to stop drinking coffee. It's my life. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Teacher. Yes. But... Um, 
um, how we try, how can we try understand uh, this in Spanish? How can translate it by? Debería de comenzar con. Debería de comenzar con dejar de beber. Debería de comenzar con empezar a ahorrar. Debería de comenzar con <laughs> parar las pupusas. Yes, exactly. Okay, thank you. Okay. Edson Stanley. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hello. Oh, man. Imagine. Okay, look what I'm doing. <laughs> Oh man, I'm very sick. Oh my chest. I don't know. It's an. Uh, I am very sick. <laughs> I don't know what I have. The doctor told me I am very sick, but I don't know why. Okay. The doctor told me that my lungs are sick, and I don't know why. What should I do? You should you should start um um by uh, visit other doctor. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see my video? Did, can you see my camera? Yes. Okay. But I am sick and the doctor is correct. I am sick. So I don't need to see another doctor. I just, I want a suggestion. Oh, okay. 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 Uh, you should, you should start uh, by uh, stop smoking. Oh man. Good. Yes. There you go. You should start by stop smoking. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Good. Very good. You see, so that's how. That's how. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Um, no, I, no, I, no, I uh, identified the the the, the scenario. The, the scenario. The, the, the cigarette. Cigarette. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It can look me algo similar cigarette. Okay. <laughs> It's okay, but no worries. Vamos a ver bien la gramática hoy. Right? So it says, so describe how to you how to do things by gerund. Okay, here's that look. By gerund. By and gerund. What is a gerund? Verb ing. Okay. Oh my God! How did you discover Jesus Christ? Oh, by going to church. Mm, it's a good example. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. By reading the Bible. By reading the Bible. Yes. Okay. Good. So let's see the video. So listen, once again, class, this is what we're doing. By and gerund. Welcome. This time we'll talk about by plus gerund and its three uses. Number one, to say how something can be done. Number two, to describe how something was done. And number three, to describe how something could be done. Remember, you could improve your grammar by taking notes. Page 53, exercise nine, grammar focus. By plus gerund to describe how to do things. You could improve your accent by listening to language CDs. I learn new words best by writing them on pieces of paper and sticking them on things. The best way to learn slang is not by reading newspapers, but by watching movies. Let's 
Okay, so this is important here. We use by and a gerund to describe how to do things. Do you understand this? It's very simple, correct? How to do things. I remember one time I asked my mother, mom, I need to dance. How do I learn how to dance? Yes, because I remember I was 15 and I went to every party. And in that time it was merengue and salsa. And the only way to get girls was to dance. But I couldn't dance. So my mother told me, wow, if you need to learn, the only way to learn is by watching people dance. So I said, mom, I need to learn how to dance. What do I do? By watching people yeah, dance. Okay. Do you understand what my mother told me? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was very simple. Bueno, vas a aprender viendo a otra gente. Hey, ahí está. Te recomiendo. Uh, oigan en español. Aprendes viendo a otra gente bailar. Si se dan cuenta, viendo es el ING en español, es el undio. Correct? Okay, so people ask me, oh man, teacher, I have problems with pronunciation. What can I do? And I said, you can improve the pronunciation by saying the word in syllables. By saying the word in syllables. For example, pharmaceutical distributor. But distributor, distributor. What the distributor, the the street, the street, distribute. No, I can't, teacher. Distributor. What? No, I can't. Distributor. Distributor. Okay. So you can improve by saying it in syllables. Distributor. Four syllables. Distributor. Four syllables. Say it in three. This tree. Butor. This tree butor. Now say it in two. This tree butor. This tree butor. This tree butor. Now say it in one. Distributor. 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 Oh, okay. I understand now, teacher. Thank you. But my my example was you can learn to pronounce by pronouncing in syllables. Okay. Now, let me see, uh, Susana. Oh man, I'm sorry, you can't talk. I'll make it easier for you. Okay, I'll make it easy for you. YouTube, YouTube. Okay, try YouTube. Was it another question? Oh man, Susana, I need to learn how to make sopa de patas. How can I make, how can I learn how to make sopa de pata? Oh, you should try by asking your grandmother. <laughs> oh, very good. Okay. You should try by asking your, your grandmother. Mm -hmm. Or by watching YouTube videos. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. When I, 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 when I try to do uh, some recipe, I always ask, my grandmother and my mother so <laughs> well you're very you're very lucky that you still have your grandmother and your mother oh. <laughs> yeah me too i always ask my mother but now i don't have my mother i ask you too <laughs> no 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 it's okay it's a long time ago but very good very good answer okay so you understand how to do things right yes teacher 
Yes. Yes. Teacher. Yeah. You you say that the couple I gave was an exception. Mm -hmm. How can I identify when I can I use an exception in? Uh, because those were those were stop. Yeah. Okay. We will see that. It's 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 in this course. That exception. Uh, it's va a estar aquí esa respuesta. You'll see why. Okay. Next. Learn slang is not by reading newspapers, but by watching movies. Let's go over each use of by plus gerund. Ready? Number one, to say how something can be done. For example, you can improve your English by doing a lot of reading. Number two, to describe how something was done. Example, I learned a lot of idioms by watching TV. Number three, to describe how something could be done. One. Okay, so we, we understand number one, to say how something can be done. What about number two, to describe how something was done? Why that happened? So, Irma... My, imagine, okay, my friend, he got cirrhosis. Mm -hmm. Why do you think this happened? Uh, can you repeat the, ask, the question, please? Sure. Uh, I have a friend that he has cirrhosis. Cirrhosis. Mm. Why do you think what happened? I couldn't understand the word, the specific word. I'm sorry. Cirrhosis. 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 Oh. I, mm, it's new for me, that word. Oh, really? Cirrhosis? I'm sorry. Cirrhosis. Okay, no, no. Oh, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Now I can understand now okay. the, the word. Okay. I couldn't on the, on the beginning, but now. Mm -hmm. Um. You, your friend should should uh, no no start. no 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 L listen I mean number what? two describe how something was done so tell me oh, what happened oh, oh yes so I okay. imagine okay, okay so I'm going to repeat so Irma man I feel sad because let me try okay but wait listen to my question please so listen to my a scenario. Mm -hmm. And I said, oh, man, Mira, I feel very bad because a good friend of mine, he has cirrhosis. I don't know how this could happen. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that it was done uh, by drinking a lot alcohol drinks. Oh, really? You think so? Oh, I didn't know that. So cirrhosis is by drinking too much. Yeah. Oh, much. okay. Yes, yeah. my friend. My friend is a big alcoholic. I had a friend uh, in the same situation too. It oh. was very sad. Oh man, I'm so sorry. He passed away. Oh, okay. Very good. You see, that's 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 to describe how something was done. Como poder pasar Yes, I understand now. Thank you so much. All right. Awesome. Good. Thank you. No, thank you. All right, and now to describe how something could be done. To describe how something could be done. One way of becoming. Hmm. Um, okay, so listen to this. Now, how something could be done is like a possibility in the future, right? Like, oh man. So, um, Class, uh, same... uh, imagine I am a tourist in El Salvador and I said, hey, class, I need your help. I I don't know San Salvador very much, so I don't know which buses to take. What do you recommend? I want, I want to see the complete San Salvador, the city, but I don't know how to move. So what do you think? Should I rent a car or what should I do? Um, can I answer? Yeah, okay. Uh, one way of becoming no is by 
hiring a tourist guy. Okay, very <laughs> good. Yeah, that's one good example. <laughs> yeah. So if you want to discover El Salvador and you don't know the buses, you know, one good way is by taking Ubers. <laughs> <laughs> or so expensive yeah yes or one good way is by taking uh by by being hiring a private guide it's expensive yeah. or or you know or one good way is by going to the web page of san salvador and see the field trips like corsones mm. you can you can know else San Salvador by looking directions in Google Map. Mm -hmm. Very good. Or you can um oh y donde voy. I don't you know you could you could know by looking at YouTubers in YouTube. El, el tío Frank is good. Do you, one? El tío Frank. O sea, de los youtubers de Salvador, para mí es el mejor porque es el más formal y todo y siempre va a lugares bonitos. So. Si uno oh. no sabe dónde ir, hey, you know, I would recommend by, look, by watching Tío Frank's videos. Okay. Yeah, because he, he always goes to a restaurant in the mountains or a place here, a place there. So, you know, you get good ideas. Because yes or no, this happens sometimes. Hey, salir, pero no sé dónde. You know, you think, you think, you think, you think, you think, you you if you want something different, you know, okay. Okay, class, so I will see you tomorrow. We'll, we'll continue this tomorrow, okay? All right, thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. I hope you feel better. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Thank Have you. Have a good night, everyone. Good night.